are ye? I've been looking into the origin of the true Irish man. Now, for thousands of years, man has wondered where he came from. Some say he came from the monkeys. Others said he came from the man above. But the true Irish man came from down below. No, not Cork. But from the potato. Now, the first process is you have to plant the seeds. There's little Tom. There's little Martin. Oh, bad seed. Back to Limerick with him. Now, if you want him to grow up to be a proper Irish lad, you have to nourish him properly in your own plot. If you want him to be a scholar, well, then plenty of Ulysses. If you want him to be a musician, you can't bait the old tin vision. And if you want him to be a GA star, a little bit of hurling. Oh, Jesus, there's one about to hatch. Come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, Jesus. Now, the Irish lad cannot be born on his own, so he needs a professional birthing consultant. <laughs> Now, the extraction process is a very slow and painful one, but luckily this clever spud has had an epidural. Oh, jeez, I think this one is blight. Now, the first thing he needs to do is to feed instantly on good old mother's milk, the black stuff. Now, every Irish lad needs a chance of an education, no matter how thick he is. Spell Madra. M. U. F. And if he doesn't learn it the first time, <coughs> it'll be better to <coughs> There's one thing that the Irish lad specialises in. A nice flake of pints. And like the famine times of his ancestors, if he can't make it here, he can always feck off to the States. <coughs> Now in the States, the Irish lad has a chance to make a new start and meet some new and interesting people. However, after a few years, when his luck runs out, he gets the calling for home. Martin, come on now! Now back in Ireland, it's time for the Irish kids to find himself a wife and start a family. Now that the Irishman has started his own family, he has to get himself a real job. But with no qualifications, a serious drinking problem, and totally oblivious to reality, he has but one option. He becomes a TD. That's the life of the typical Irish man, and if you don't believe me, you can fuck off. <laughs>